the subtle message here is that, look, we got so many things that are going just so wonderfully well. I mean, this is a clear and obvious choice that Biden, this is what they want you to think, that he's the choice, that he's the candidate. When in reality, when in reality, their problem is all of the, their problem is the candidate. It's not that we need to see the candidate stay more on message. The problem is the candidate sucks. The problem is the message itself sucks. The agenda of this administration is absolutely terrible. The success and the track record of what they've had the last three and a half years, absolutely abysmal. You just go on down the line. There's nothing. There's it, It's everything but the messaging. You've got a media that has been trying to help you carry the water. You've had a Department of Justice that has been targeting your political opponent to try to put him in prison. Not just the federal Department of Justice. You've got some states getting in into the mix as well. You've got Fannie Willis. You've got Alvin Bragg. You've got all these jokers and clowns, all these folks, all these folks who are trying to take down the opponent, Trump. We've got efforts to keep him off of ballots. We've got all of these things, right? We've got court cases everywhere, Supreme Court hearing for this, that, and the other. We want Trump to be in courtrooms, not on the campaign trail. That's what they want. And, and they still have no traction. They still have absolutely no success. Here's an article to, I guess, or a poll to cement that thought if you needed that. Biden's comment about women not only gets ratioed, I was talking about a post on social media, but new poll shows him in big trouble with women. <laughs> 